So recently I was doing a work on my EPS file and I wasn't able to open the EPS file in that in space and I was always getting this error again and again. So so guys in this video basically I'm going to show you how you can fix this app. So let's get started with this video. So first of all what you need to do is just simply just go ahead and just download the uh, go uh, script guys. I will just put the link in the description guys. So just go ahead and just download this uh, on the basis of your operating system. So currently my operating system is Windows 32. Oh my god. And the, so that's it. Just go ahead and just download this app. So once you have downloaded this app guys what you need to do is just simply just go ahead and install this app. And once you have done with the installation guys what you need to do is now just simply just uh, go ahead to the C then program files and now you basically will see a folder named as GS and open that up and again open that up and until you see this directory guys so basically here you will see the two folders one is the bin and one is the library so what you need to do is just go ahead and rename this bin folder to any so in my case I'm just renaming it to GK for instance and what then what you need to do is now just go ahead and open the library folder itself guys and just to, uh, copy the whole files uh, which is showing here and just go ahead and paste this in this gk folder which you have just created so once you have pasted uh, this whole file then what you do is just simply just cut or copy this gk folder to your c uh, uh, c drive and that's it so once you're done with this guys then what you do is just simply just go ahead and in the command types uh, this uh, systems advanced properties and once you're there uh, just basically you will see some pop up like they have and tap on the environmental variables guys and once you're here what you need to do uh, first for, first of all you have to check whether you have a uh, variable named as path so if yes then what you need to do is now select the path variable and just select on edit I just uh, simply add the semicolon and just add the directory that is the c uh at gk this one and if on the other hand if you doesn't have a path variable guys then do no need to worry just simply click on this new and just uh, name the uh, name it as a path the c so semicolon dash gk and that's it once you're done just go ahead and click on ok and that's it so now let's try to open the eps file in the namespace as you can see so so the most probability is that you are able to open the eps file by a uh, team now uh, but if you are able to do that and if you are getting this error guys no need to worry what you need to do is just simply go ahead to see windows system to do now just simply just copy this directory similarly go ahead to the path for path variable which you have created now go ahead and add a semicolon again so and now just go ahead and paste the, this up so that's it so once you have that just go ahead and okay just uh, now let's go ahead and check uh, again and as as you can see now I'm able to edit my EPS file and I can open this in my space.